Hello and welcome everyone. My name is Bruises and in today's video I'll be giving you news on the Green Hell updates. Before we get started make sure to leave a thumbs up if you're new to the channel make sure to subscribe as it's free to do and you can always unsubscribe anytime. With that being said let's get straight into the news. Okay so the latest news I do have is first of all that the part 3 of the expansion will be coming to the PC version on the 29th so that's tomorrow but the console a lot of people are complaining about bugs and stuff on the console the game not working and still stuck on uh, spirits of Amazonia part 1 now I did tweet to the Green Hell um, Twitter page and they did reply to me which I'm actually happy to share to you guys about so they said we're still committed to the consoles Here's the official statement uh, from a weeks back, from a few weeks back. So they replied, "Hello, adventurers. Adventurers, um, we understand that players on PS4 and Xbox One haven't had the update and fixes they've been hoping for. Uh, we feel that you, our valued supporters, deserve direct information and transparency from us. Expand the image below." and I will read to you guys what the image does say so they did reply to me with this tweet on Twitter now reading to you guys what the note says okay the image is like in a little book form uh, it gives you the green hell vibes I will try and post an image but it, it might be hard but anyways getting into what they do say here is to our valued green hell adventurers first and foremost we want to express our undying gratitude for your support and commitment for our or to our title without it we wouldn't be able to expand and enhance our game the way we do so that's just basically them thanking us for playing the game and buying the game and so forth and then continues on for our console players this letter is dedicated to you most of all we hear uh, we hear and acknowledge the comments and feedback you provide to us every day and we think you deserve an update concerning the development of green health uh, both on xbox one and playstation 4 the console edition of green hell is far from abandoned due to the relatively smooth pipelines we experienced while porting the base game we plan to deliver the spirits of amazon part 1 and part 2 expansions to the console edition swiftly after launch however the size of the new content added including a new map and vast as in the base game along with unique gameplay mechanics character and items made the porting process a much more challenging task than we expected okay so that was the first page now the second page does say during the merging process of both expansions and the execution of major bug fixes to the base game we experienced performance significantly below our standards the FPS drops uh, are still our main stumbling block uh, in bringing the spirits of Amazonia part 1 and part 2 expansions to the console edition so what they basically say there is that the the spirits of Amazonia part 2 because we do have part 1 as far as I'm aware but part 2 is on its way it's just going to take a little longer than we do expect it to take because it's hard to port it and they have to work on a lot of bug fixes also the frame drop issue as you guys can see in the background there was a couple of frame drops um, and it does make the game a little less playable but they're trying to fix it before the update that we got like on the launch the game was good and I'm positive that they will take it back to that okay and then it continues we have been dedicating a lot of uh, lot of our resources to both optimizing the game port and improving the performance we remain committed to bringing you the best green hell experience across all our platforms and for that we humbly ask you to bear with us a little longer uh, with sincerely green a uh, creepy jar sorry I almost said green hell but creepy jar team um, 
yeah so that is what the letter does say and this does give us a lot of important information coming down to the part that we are getting um, the spirits of Amazonia part 2 and maybe even part 3 but we just need to be patient it's gonna take some time if you get frustrated with the game just play something else maybe start a new game put yourself some challenges just calm down and enjoy the game as is I know a lot of games does get broken after the first update but some developers do dedicate their time into the game and actually fix the frame drop issues and bug fixes so all we can do now is give them their time that they need and hope for the best um, and a lot of people as I've seen in the comments is mouse and keyboard on console they did say um, no plans for that at this time and so forth but we'll get into more news in the future um, but if you guys are experiencing any type of bugs you're more than welcome to tell me and I will try my best to report it to them uh, again but remember they are working on bug fixes and it is taking some time so yeah if you enjoyed this video if this video was helpful make sure to leave a like and please subscribe to my channel as it will help me out a lot thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video Huh! <gasps>